Now we're going to determine what real numbers a make this polynomial x cubed plus ax squared plus ax plus 1 equals 0 have three real solutions. The first thing to notice is that negative 1 is a solution. It means we should be able to factor this with an x minus negative 1 or an x plus 1. From there you can either do polynomial long division or just guess and check until you get x squared plus a minus 1 times x plus 1 on the outset. But for our equation of three real solutions, this must have two real solutions which means the discriminant of this must be non-negative. So we have a minus 1 squared minus 4 has to be bigger than or equal to 0. That means that a minus 1 squared has to be bigger than or equal to 4. Taking the square root, we see that a minus 1 has to be bigger than or equal to 2, or a minus 1 has to be less than or equal to negative 2. That means that a is bigger than or equal to 3, or a is less than or equal to negative 1. And those are our values of a that make this work out.